I'm your host, Susan Tehrani. First, let's get this hour's headlines out of the way and then first into our first. Russia's military says that Ukraine fired U.S. supplied long range missiles at a military facility in the Brine's border region in what would be the first attack since Washington authorized the use of its weapons. <coughs> Ukrainian President Vladimir Zelensky says that 2025 will be decisive in determining who wins the war unleashed by Russia almost three years ago. U.S. envoy almost Hodgstein in Beirut says that he held very constructive talks and there is real opportunity to end the Israel-Hezbollah war. Hezbollah says that it fired missiles at Israeli intel base near Tel Aviv. Israel says five people have been wounded in the rocket of barrages on Israel. Attacks target central and northern Israel. Walmart raised its full year earnings forecast after a surge in third quarter profit hitting $4.6 billion driven by strong U.S. sales and e-commerce growth. G20 leaders hold a final day of talks after failing to break a deadlock in U.N. climate negotiations as they close out a summit in Rio dominated by divergences over the war in Ukraine and Trump's return to the White House. The first snow of the season hit parts of the UK, including the capital, London, as people in some areas woke up to a winter wonderland. <laughs> 